In this video, we'll be going over the bottom-up constant space approach of climbing stairs. This is part 4 of the 4-part series. So let's first go do the dot process. In the very bottom-up approach, in each, of the, in each of the iteration, we are only relying on values from indices i-1 and i-2. This is the number of ways if we take one step or if we take two steps. This means we can use two variables to keep track of these values instead of an array. In each of the iteration, we will be updating these two values, these two variables. Now let's go do a pseudocode. Let's validate the input parameter. If n is equal to zero or n is equal to 1, then we only have one weight, then we return 1, then we'll create two variables, ways 1, the number of ways it would take one step, so initially it's going to be 1, and then ways 2, the number of ways it would take two steps, so initially it's also going to be 1. We can think, we, we can think of this as if we're starting from step 1, and we can think of this if we're starting from step two. Um, st st not starting from step one, starting from step zero. So we're going to iterate through the indices from two to n, denote it as i. Find the total number of ways at the current step. Ways go to ways one plus ways two. That's the number of ways you would take one step and the number of ways you would take two steps and then return ways 1. Now let's go over the time and space complexity. The time complexity is go to O of n, where n is the input value. Visit each index once. And our space complexity is go to O of 1, because we're not using array anymore. Let's go over the code. If n is go to 0, or n is go to 1, then there's only one way, return 1, and we'll create our two variables, ways 1 and ways 2. And we'll iterate through the steps, find the total number of ways at the current step, and then update our two variables. Oh, we need to update two variables. Update ways 1. Uh, ways 2 to ways 1 and then update ways 1 to the current number of steps. Okay. And then ways 1, let's go to ways. There, we can return ways 1. Let me know if you have any questions in the comment section below.